short video of the exposure blaze tail lamp, which is just too bright. You can't really see estimate distance from the bags here. Some motorists or tailing cyclists can sort of judge distance. But if you don't have that, then this is totally unsuited to any judgment of distance or speed. Well, the light distribution is fairly nice with the somewhat frosted lens. Uh, it should just be driven at the lower current and no flashing mode. Here are the exposure strata and I wanted to show you here all the reflective signs there because they're working on the road. They are lit up. Oh wait. This is the low mode. Now I'm going to switch it off. Switch on Damn, safe ride 80. Uh, let's illuminate this properly. So it has also reflection, of course. You see the traffic signs, but not as, as strongly as with the Strada. This is much better. It also works a lot better in actually illuminating the road with about 270 lumens and Philip said that 220 is in the main beam and I presume they mean I guess onto the road and not the artifacts to the side etc. And Strada is, if the name is indicative, 1200 lumens and yet it's not really better. Uh, at long distance it's worse. It does not illuminate the road as well as the Safe Ride 80 does. But okay, I uh, need to adjust it a bit again. It's a bit too high. It's like this. The cutoff actually is not that sharp in the Safe Ride 80. Otherwise, there would be far less reflection from the traffic, from these traffic signs and. Uh, what do you call these? Fence, not a fence, okay. Here I'm going through the town and I'll switch on the strada. Ay, 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 ay. Where do I need to go? Where can I go? Let's see. I guess not. I guess I need to ride another way. Alright, that's it for now.